Video time, video time. Here we go. Got some cool stuff for Sunday. That's what I'm going to go through and look at some of these Victorian, like the Victorian syrup pitcher. You got your biscuit jar. Wonderful glass on that covered pitcher. Some nice art glass back in there. Got your Tweety Bird in a cage. Some military. Um, military medals and coin silver up there. Look at this great little piece, Temple Bar. Let me show it on the back side. It's kind of hard since we're on the on the floor trying to look at all these things. Sundays is going to be a really fun auction. Another antique and collectible sale. A lot of great variety of things. Still getting the, a lot of the work set. We'll start doing the catalogs tomorrow and then we'll have them up. There is a, uh, about 80 lots live and online that you can bid on right now. Look at all the Hummels. My goodness. Mm -hmm. So many of these will be put in groups and sold together in Piles. Some of them are the little Hummel um, Christmas ornaments, studio Hummels. So we'll lose those. I'm going to slide on over here. Um, lots of really cool things here. This is a Tiffany and Company piece. Um, this piece is that um, Artini sculpture engravings. Got a piece of Rookwood up here. The large. Hummel's pieces down there. This is that Pablo Casals. It is a signed autographed copy um, book there with a photograph of him. There are some signed footballs. Again, you'll see a lot of those on live and online. You can check those out. Lots of Majelica. Look at all this cool Majelica. Came through here. I remember Majelica at one time was so popular. Some Sterling. Lots of signs, memorabilia, guys. Lots and lots of signs. A lot of these books are all signed, autographed by the authors. And take a look at them. I'm going to try to get some information out. We'll have the catalogs done hopefully by Saturday, maybe afternoon, and you can look online and see what it is. We have a lot of these little footballs, some more basketballs, more footballs. There's a cool football helmet there. Um, I would tell you who, they, who they're signed by, but I don't know, diddly, diddly, diddly about football, you know, because I grew up in Maine and it was all about ice hockey. Um, this week we've got a lot of mid-century modern, so this whole area, see all the bright yellow, we're going to wander through that and tell you a little bit about what we've got. Um, that whole cabinet right there is the yellow fiesta. Yellow seems to be the color of the day. This is wonderful, that 1960s great sunburst uh, Franciscan wear. That this is a contemporary set now is for the china cabinet and a table but really good quality so you can take a look at that jumping on over this way got some really cool paintings look at that one right there my dancing all the Florida highwaymen art those are all live and online look at this wonderful 50s lamp all that great pottery We've got sets of the peacock stained glass and then this is a nice rattan set it has the sideboard in the back little side table got the fan the fan chairs back it up got the cow the sofa the chairs the coffee table look at that cool lamp isn't that fun Lots of 50s stuff, 50s, 60s, mid-century modern. It's really hot right now. A lot of people like this kind of stuff. So just come on down, take a look at it. I'm going to do a quick walk through. Bright yellow sunshine. Here you go. This, <laughs> again, they got that whole 70s look going. Now these are Russian artists. These are signed Russian artists. The young lady that brought them in was an art dealer over in Russia. She came back. They are, I mean, they've got some great auction records. We've just put two of each artist up. The information is online. You can take a look at that. Some more 50s drop-down bar. Lot, lot a lot of the um, uh, ringware, some enamelware, there's some Pyrex, there's a couple of cards, and look at this great little J Weller Jardinier and Pestle. Really cool. Now we're buzzing over into the Oriental section. Look at the size of that needlepoint. Wonderful, 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 wonderful. And then there you have a little pedestal. Look at this dining room, black lacquer dining room tables with the table and chairs. There's all the inlay through here. Got some things. Now it looks a little bit going on because we're still setting up. Today's Thursday so we're doing the walkabout auction outside trench art this is a great silver plate it says look at the lines in there coming back through got a nice little mahogany dining room set a couple corner tables some deities moriano look at that carpet right there back it up back it up there's a silver plate set some more here 
nice little needle point seat and back, drum table through here. Now this china cabinet right here, swing it around, there's some depression, lots of desert rose, hall pottery, all kinds of cool stuff in here, more than the Norman Rockwells. But I show, swing it around because I want to show you the sideboard that goes along with that china cabinet right here. Lots of carving, great three-piece set to sit on top of that sideboard. And look at this deco style. Isn't she sweet? There you go. And then you've got yourself your cranberry glass pedestal. I'm going to zoom back over here because I want to show you something because it's the neatest thing. There's a pair of matched. Look how cool these, these are. Urns there. And then this is all early Masonic stuff. Freemasonry, Masonics. Um, it's called The Builders. And it's got, uh, you know, 1921, 22, 1915. Uh, a lot of other Freemason stuff in through here, all the lodge things. So you can see all that cool stuff. So I'm going to move on over. Now I'm going to have to kind of duck around some of the people here because we do have Thursday's walkabout, whatever we're doing right here. There's a piece of Clary's Cliff in here. And then there's this wonderful stone carving. She's so pretty. Cedar chest. This little marble top East Lake with this with the candle stands and some cut to clear ruby. Those are kind of cool. Lots of postcards. Lots of cool paper. That's going to be a lot of fun. Backing up, backing up. Okay, swinging around. Excuse me, excuse me, as we jump over into the country section. Now, I'm going to do a quick buzz because look at all the cool stuff. And then I'll go through and do a walkthrough. Okay, step on over. Got sewing rockers, so Martha Washington sewing cabinet. Um, got an early singer in the case. Look how pretty. I mean, the work they put into these things is just amazing. And I am so glad I don't have to iron with one of them puppies anymore. Not that I ever iron anything anyway. Um, check out this and iron set, screen, look the things, there's the sunflowers, um, this is a tavern table, it flips up and you can have the, it's, you can turn it into a bench or a tavern table, it's got the little trunk in the bottom, look at this, look at that spinning wheel, gargantuan, got yourselves a um, crank record player, got some more things going on over here, this is a great set of woven seats, look at the wheat cut pattern in the back over this way. Spin it around. Another East Lake piece of furniture. Marble top. Got the acorn pulls. Lennox spice set. There's some Audubon prints. Nicely framed. Uh, lift top cabinet to commode right there. Nice, nice, nice drop leaf sets. This is a great little set. It's got four little table. It's got a table and four little chairs. Um, this is this is a newer piece. It's a reproduction, but it's a nice little cabinet. It actually has the original paperwork in here. Um, got all this bake light in here for where it's called the American Collection Museum of American Folk Art. So that's a cool piece there. Coming around. Got a collection of husband beaters. <laughs> then you got your chicken coop up there, your white rocker, some really cool bake light pieces. Um, nice little cabinet here. Again, that's more of the shabby chic king size headboard. Newer piece, but still fits in really well. Blends well with all of your antiques and collectibles. Yeah, some crocs over here. Some cool little advertising pieces. Another shabby chic kind of chest there. This is a car trunk. Another trunk over this way. Everybody's looking around, and lots and lots of decoys. I think we got a dozen or so decoys. Aren't they nice? I mean, nice collection. You're just never quite sure what you're going to find when you come clean out a house. There's another nice little table and chairs. Drop leaf. Got the woven seats. Nice croc. Spinning around. Lots of the gray enamel wear. Um, there's the tilt top Griswold come up, um, pot. Um, this is a cool little thing. Talk about great for identification. It's an early catalog. It's got all kinds of cool stuff in it. So, I mean, that would be a nice piece to have just to get some kind of idea when you're finding something. Um, the blue ring stoneware. Going to jump on over here again. More duck decoys. Well, hey there. Nice little, look at the round base on this one. This is just so cool. It's got the deep round drawers in the bottom of them. Nice little side chairs. Now I'm zooming through here, and it's a little bit piled. Things are going to be a little bit different when you come through. But this is the kids section. Some of the toys, some of the vintage pieces through here. There's some cool stuff. Home Planetarium. Look at this ring toss. These early little sewing machines. Um, this is the Hurly Gurly. It's in, it's in the um, original box. 
this is one of those convertible rocking chair and then you can lift it up make it in a high chair this one is in its original shipping this little stroller it's got the instruction manuals in it nice condition real real nice condition nice little wash stand great linens these are all Wallace nuttings now look at them all one two three four five six I think there's seven of them total and then over here these are original paintings um, pastels of of a, a Irish setter there was a uh, show dog if you look up here there are some of his um, ribbons over there and we have a whole thing of pewter trophies a ton of them this is a cool equestrian carpet uh, hiding under here and we got some more there's your crank chickens there's some toys there's the Andy Handy Andy this way there's your fire department pedal car nice little maple stand and then up here you got I got four of these really cool um, Coca-Cola posters and look at this Seals and Sterling Four Ring Circus. They got one on eBay right now that people are just asking big, big money for. A lot of enamel wear. I got this nice little tin cup, tin pie safe. Another high chair. Just, just fun stuff. Now here we come. There's another thing that's unusual. You know, a lot of times people will send us their entire collections. And this is one gentleman, Mr. Nani, uh, the gentleman that we're still working with out of Pine Ridge that had a huge collection of vintage Mexican pottery. I mean, he just got all kinds of them. And it's very nice. Plus, there's some great um, art from that neck of the woods. Just some really nice pieces. Now check this out. We're going to be selling them in groups and by the shelf and that sort of thing. So look at this chicken. I love this chicken. That's a great pot. Great for roasting. So there's all kinds of cool stuff. I didn't even show you the jewelry. We got probably 40 pieces of vintage estate jewelry. A lot of them are in sets. Those are going to be here. The gold coins are here. I didn't have that. Those aren't still out on the safe. So there's a lot of stuff that I haven't had a chance to show you that will be here at this sale. So go ahead and make sure you come by this way. Take a look. It's going to be great fun. We'll see you on Sunday. Preview starts at 10. The auction starts at 1. We'll see you then. Bye.